What is Christmas like in the back rooms? Merry Christmas, everyone. I hope you're having a great day if you celebrate it. And if you don't, I still hope you're having a fantastic day. Thank you all so much for your support on this year's Brugmas. It's been fantastic, and we're capping it off with a very fitting level. Now, have you ever thought about what Christmas is like inside the back rooms? I mean, the back rooms is a terrible, horrible, and even awful place, but surely there's got to be some Christmas cheer somewhere. Well, luckily for you, there's back rooms level 941, which is what I'll be explaining in this video. Let's get into it, shall we? So Backrooms Level 941, aka Holiday Spirit, is classified as a Class 1 difficulty and is safe, secure, and has a small entity count. The level physically looks like a house that's been decorated for Christmas. There's Christmas trees, fireplaces, wreaths, lights, garland, and literally every type of Christmas decoration that you would see in a big fancy house. Now the house itself is way bigger on the inside than it looks on the outside and it has a ton of rooms. But the main thing about this level is the calming feeling that it gives everyone who comes here. Just a relaxing Christmas type of vibe. I mean, how can it get any better? In every room, there is a radio system that plays old Christmas music. And when that's turned on, it just adds to the chillness of the level. Now alongside there being living rooms, there's also kitchens connected to them. These kitchens are full of food, specifically food that you'd find at a traditional American Christmas dinner. Ham, gravy turkey, mashed potatoes, apple cider, jello, that type of thing. There's also desserts, if anyone's wondering. The food is always fresh and it's always safe to eat, and this level is just getting better and better to me. Now, if you walk out of the kitchen, you'll be in a living room. One of them, at least. They're all massive, and they all have huge Christmas trees in them. All the trees have presents under them, and everything's just fully decorated and maxed out. It's like Christmas threw up all over these rooms. There's actually a few spots in the level where you can find a staircase that goes up. These staircases, of course, are also decorated with garland and lights, but if you walk up the stairs, you'll see some bedrooms and bathrooms, which also are decorated for Christmas. And that's all fun and dandy inside, but you can actually go outside of the house if you want to, and if you do, you'll see a yard that's covered in snow. The level stays around 20 degrees Fahrenheit, or negative 6 Celsius, and it's pretty chilly, so you probably should wear a coat. Now, the house itself is actually alone, and it's in the middle of a forest, and there are no other buildings close to you. It's just one normal-looking house that's way bigger on the inside than on the outside, sitting out in the middle of the forest with decorations everywhere. If you do wander into the forest, it doesn't matter how far you do, you'll eventually no-clip back to the front of the house. But you might think the holiday joy stops there. Well, you'd be wrong. If you walk down the dirt path that leads to and from the house, you'll eventually walk to a town. Now, you can only do this by finding where the dirt road is, because if you don't go and you just go out to the middle of the woods, you'll get sent back to the house. The dirt road will be covered in snow, but you have to fight it to get to the town. The town itself is a very festive and populated town, and it's populated with faceling entities. Of course, you guessed it, the town is decorated for Christmas. There are shops and buildings, and it looks like a nice older town. The buildings are inside and out decorated, but there are a few specific buildings that I will mention. A food market, a skating rink, and a Christmas tree store. There's even a candy store. But yeah, it's pretty much like a Christmas town. How can you go wrong with a Christmas town? Let's be real. Now, you might think that the holiday joy ends there too, maybe. But again, you'd be wrong. Because if you walk to the end of the road through the town, you'll find a mine. Yes, a mine. And this mine is more like a cave, but inside of it, you'll see a Christmas decoration heaven as well. Hanging lights, presents, garland, everything like that in this mine is just a it's just a Christmas mine. I mean, what else can I say? Inside the mine, there are actually gems that smell like peppermint. That's pretty much it. It's just like Christmas vomited inside of a mine. If you want to go back to the original house from the town or from the mine, all you have to do is walk off the road, back to the woods, and you'll be teleported back to the house, and then you can just chill there as long as you want to. That's where I'd be staying, because I love Christmas, and I couldn't get enough of it. But whatever you do, listen to what I'm about to say. Do not go to this last part of the level, because this spot is dangerous. 
The last part is the basement, and it can randomly be accessed if a set of downward stairs appears. They're pretty rare, but if they do, do not walk down there because nobody has a clue what's down there. It could be entities, could be nothing but darkness. All we know is that we can't see all the way down. It's just dark. Stay upstairs where it's chill and colorful. I mean, why would you want to leave? But yeah, how can you not love an entire level dedicated to Christmas? If you don't like it, there's a good chance that you're a Scrooge, for real. And who wants to be a Scrooge? That's it for the video. Thank you so much for watching. This was a pretty just relaxing and lighthearted level, and it fits the theme of Christmas perfectly, so leave a like if you enjoyed that, and thank you all so much. I hope you're having a Merry Christmas. I just appreciate all of you for all you do for me. You all are the best gift that I could ask for. Okay, that was really cringe sounding, but I did mean it. I love each and every one of you. Comment Merry Christmas to spread around the joy to all the other people watching, and I really do hope you're having a great day. I hope you got everything you asked for. If you don't celebrate Christmas, Christmas. I also hope you're having a great day, of course. I guess it's just a normal day for you, but seriously, thank you all so much. I love and appreciate each and every one of you. Click the top link in the description if you want to go check out the merch. Today is the last day you can use code Brugmas for 10% off your order. So if you want to snag 10% off for like a hoodie for the rest of winter, today's your last day. After that, it'll go back to normal price. Also, while you're down there, check out my other channels. If you're bored, you might have something. If you don't have anything else to do today, if you're between meals or between family, check out some uh, Brugly 2 or Spoogly videos. Anyways, that's enough self promoing. I love and appreciate all of you. I cannot wait for this next year. I've got huge things planned. I hope you're ready to stick around for it. Hope you're here for the ride. I love you all, and I will see you in a couple of days. But for now, Merry Christmas, everybody. I love you.